I rescued this orchid from Lowe's discount rack. It had rotted leaves, it had rotted roots, the whole stem, nothing viable. I soaked it in garlic water, just two cloves of garlic and a cup of water, two cups if you need. I cut off everything. There's nothing viable about this and it has the rotten smell to it. So none of this is good. So I cut it down to the stem, down to the sternum of the plant. The same plastic pot that it comes in, I'm gonna use this. I've washed it out, I've cleaned it. Now, this is what I do with my other orchids that I've rescued from Lowe's. I'll take the same plastic pot and I'll cut off the top of it. This plant at this point has no roots. So it needs access to water, but it needs to be able to grow its own roots without being over soaked. So I'll cut off the top of it discard this. It has holes in it. Now I'm going to put my premium. This is my special blend. You can find it in my Etsy shop. Okay. Put some in the bottom. You don't need to pre-soak it. Take this plastic part and set it inside, just like that. I'm gonna put the stem right in the middle there. And then fill in potting soil around it so it's stable. Now, now it has access to water. I'm gonna do the regular watering cycle like I do all my other orchids. I, I water it once a week. This I will give one cup of water once, a, once every two weeks for this particular one because it's recovering. If it were a healthy plant and had plenty of roots, I would. But this one I'm gonna give it one cup of water every two weeks. When I start seeing the roots there, then I'll know it's ready for more water.